Welcome to Tech Brothers. In this video, we're going to learn how to export a model in Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012. In order to do that, we're going to use Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012 PowerShell, and we're going to use the utility called axutil.exe. So uh, well, let's go to the server. And here is, uh, I have already fired up, but I'll uh, go back and show you that how to get there. So you click on start, go to administrative tools, up here is uh, Microsoft Dynamics AX management shell so you're gonna go ahead right click and run as administrator first when you run it it's gonna be in Windows system 32 but our AX util exists in a program file uh, Microsoft Dynamics AX and then 60 server and then your instance name um, I'm going I have already fired it up so I'm going to show you real quick so let me clear this up as you can see it's a program files Microsoft Dynamics AX 60 servers and then instance name in my case it's AX prod so um, what we're gonna do in this is uh, use the export command in um, uh, Microsoft Dynamics AX util if you don't know how to uh, what are the commands AX util offers so we're gonna go ahead AX util dot exe and then dash and question mark and you will see all the commands and parameters that uh, you can use using axutil.exe so we're gonna use a command called export so we're gonna go, go ahead axutil.exe export um, first of all that um, in, in terms of uh, uh, exporting what exactly um, we want to export and where to export these these two or three things that uh, it needs so we're, we're going to export it into file so we're gonna go ahead and do forward slash file and now we need to give the file address which would be C backslash C colon backslash um, whatever the the uh, your directory is you wanted to give but uh, I'm going to uh, give directory um, just directly into C and I'm going to do um, this is my um, this is my model that I wanted to export GER uh, and all the models keep in mind when you export using AX util they need to have extension a dot AX model so this is the extension that we will, we will, uh, it will accept and uh, it will export to that particular address and next thing is that um, uh, what exactly this is the file name that I have just given ger.ax model and uh, next thing what exactly we wanted to export that would be a model and then we will provide the model name so forward slash model and then which model ger I'll show you uh, in a little bit the list of model um, models that I have um, and uh, that's that's all you need to do really and press enter as you can see it's um, it's exporting so if we wanted to look at that uh, if it has really exported so we're gonna go ahead and look and see and as you can see ger.ax model is ex that file is exported in here so let's uh, just quickly show you that uh, axutil.exe and look at the list of the models you just provide a command list hit enter and these are my models uh, some are system uh, layer model and other are user layer model so you can uh, one is a cus layer model so you can uh, look at the list of the model using list command and you can uh, export the model using export command um, and it's really easy and I hope it helps